Hey everybody, how's it going? Sin here, back for some more adventures in Oblivion. Now, last time, uh, I said that I was gonna take care of those Oblivion Gates outside of, uh... Outside of each major city, off camera, because they're a bitch. <laughs> I'm sorry for my language, but they are. So I got the allies for Bruma. Also, I got two Sigil Stones that gave me a pretty good buff on my magic. 50 instead of the usual 24, so... I went and did that, and, well, figured it was time for a change of wardrobe. So, yeah, we did that, because why not? You know, we can enchant, so we did it. And, uh, I'd like to show you a little something that comes from getting allies for Bruma. Because, remember, the Mythic Dawn planned to eventually do what they did to Kavach to Bruma, so... We're gonna need friends. So we got Coral. Hello there. The Dawn won't dare try anything now that the best Damn soldiers in Cyrodiil are defending Bruma. I like the way I like your attitude, soldier. We got Skin Grab. Excuse me, Anvil. Beautiful, aren't they? Almost makes you forget why we're here. Yeah, you're right. But take heart, take heart. So we got Coral. We got Anvil. But wait, there's more. Leowin. I can't stay long. Count Caro's orders were to return to Leowin as soon as Bruma was safe. And you will. And you will. Take care. Be seeing you. We even have a guard, a guard soon. captain by the look of it. Ah, Kavach. Remember Kavach. Indeed. That's our watchword. We won't let that happen here. <laughs> Don't worry. I believe you. I believe you. Bye. And and of course we'd. We'd be remiss to leave out the the, the brave soldiers of Shadenhall. I'm sure you hear it all the time, but I'd like to thank you personally. We were all expecting to become the next Kavat, you know. With the Count worrying more about his son than the defense of the ah, city. Ah, yes, I'll get to that in a second too. So, like I said, thanks. All right. So, um, what I want that reminded me. Thank so you. there was a quest associated with uh, Shadenhall's Oblivion Gate. Where I had the opportunity to rescue the Count's son, who was pretty much, you know, a pampered, would-be knight. And I rescued him, and his father, the Count, allowed me to choose between a sword and a staff. I figured I already have a pretty awesome sword, so why not get the Staff of Indaris? It's very powerful if you look at it. Look, 15 points in 10 feet, 60 points on target, and damage the strength. And look, it's unique. Isn't that isn't that lovely? Look at that. There's there's vines all around it. I like this. I think it'll save our butt in the battles to come. So, we took care of that. Now what I would like to do is um what I would like to do is get that artifact from Azura for our own purposes and we're going to need to get the armor of Tiber Septim for Martin's ritual. So I think what we'll do first is we will um we'll head to Azura Shrine. Cuz yeah, you know, the Azura Star, that's her artifact. It, like I said before, it's said to be it's said to be a grand soul gem that is reusable. I mean, which which mage wouldn't want that? Plus, you know, as a lore master, to be able to study such an artifact that's only grazed you know, a few hands in the history of Tamriel. Well, <laughs> who would who would pass that up, really? Come on. So we'll just uh, make our way up this treacherous slope. Hopefully, we can find a pathway or something. So we're not too far from it. It's just these these hills, you know. There's Shaden Hall. All right, and also, I mean, we have that assignment from the Arcane University to visit that alien ruin. We'll get to that eventually when we need to get some more Welkin stones for our adventures. Oh, great! Look at that—it's another Oblivion Gate. Well, I can promise you one thing: I don't really want to go in it, especially because off camera, I just—I just did a bunch of them. Like I said, you know what? We'll do. Uh, We'll treat the source of the problem, not the symptoms. The sooner we can stop this invasion, the better. 
And if Maroon's Dagon's minions patrol the wilds, in the meantime, well, so be it. My hands are tied. But we must be pretty close to, um, to Azura's Shrine. We can just get up this ridge. Come on, come on now. Now I'd really like to work on my uh, my swordsmanship too. You know, we need to get our strength up, particularly because what better way to learn the ways of the sword to study them? Because think about it, even even you know skills with a blade. Even though we're particularly um, a wizard, so to speak. It's a lore master. We want to learn all disciplines. So to be able to learn how to use such a powerful artifact, that will only benefit us in our journeys. Alright, that's the gutted mine. But where's the Shrine of Azura? Remember, it was marked on our map. Ooh, look at that monstrosity. Don't you change color, you sky. Don't you do it. Wormwood. Oh no, you don't. It's that perfect chance to work on our uh, on our skills with the blade. All right. How's that for the bare necessities? You know what? Be gone. Okay, Azura Shrine. Ah, it's this way. Okay. I was heading in the wrong uh, direction, cardinally. Bare necessities. Simple bare necessities. Ah, you know what? I think I see it. I'll face you. Come here. Alright, you know what? Let's speak to you. You look like a priest. Hello there. You have entered a holy place. What is your business here? Ah, the Dunmer love Azura. This is the shrine of Azura, queen of the dawn and the dusk. What is your business here, traveler? Um, I'd actually, you know, I'd like to speak with Azura if I could. If you wish to speak to the lady, visit her shrine at dawn or dusk. Leave her an offering of glow dust. And glow dust, huh? I don't really have any glow dust handy. Oh, look at that mountain lion down there. All right, time for that Simba shit. Oh, completely pooped on this one was. Completely pooped on. All right, maybe there are some Will-O-Wisps nearby. But I don't know, something tells me there, there may not be. Wow, another one. I know what we'll do. We'll just head to, uh, we'll just head to the market district. I'm sure we can purchase some. Corrupt Imperial Watchmen. We might have to look into that sometime. But first, I need that artifact. We still have some time before the shops close. What's going on with you? It's, it's you. Ah. The main ingredient. Hopefully you have what I'm looking for. In fact, I know you will. Hello there, sir. Finally. A new customer. That's me. I'm a new customer. I have potions and everything you need to make your own. What will it be? Do you have glow dust, perhaps? 
Ah, you have just what I needed. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Take care. Thank okay. you. All right. I wonder if we'll make it in time. He says leave an offering at dawn or dusk. I wonder if it's still technically dusk. Nothing happens. Well, looks like we're going to have to wait a while. We'll wait till the dawn. So Azura is one of the Daedric princes that's, you know, kind of benevolent. Remember, Daedra don't have morality, so to speak. But her sphere tends... She's very benevolent. You know, so it's not evil like Mayrun's Dagon, by our judgments. Yes. I have seen your name, Traveler. Oh my. And heard it whispered in twilight. We're not to be trifled with. I ask a service. Joe's promise of fame and reward. Many years ago, five followers slew the vampire Dratic and its kin, but all were infected by the foul creature. Knowing their fate, they sealed themselves up in the vampire's lair. That's noble. Their suffering that is sacrifice. Travel to the gutted mine. The door will Oh, we to found me. that. Bring the peace of death to my followers. I shall. You shall earn my gratitude. Thank you, my lady. The gutted mine. Ah, so they slew a powerful vampire by the looks of it. Let's do this. Oh my. Well, they definitely reset the traps, that's for sure. What if they were expecting company at all? Alright, we better be extra careful. We don't want to be infected. Oh no. Stay back. I have an idea. I'll take you out into the sunlight. That's right, come out and fight me here. You blood blood fiend, you feral beast. Hey, come on. I don't bite, but the sun sure will. Do I have to spell it out for you? Come on outside. Where are you going? Come on! Oh, goodness. Ooh! I'll take this gear. Should have expected one of these... one of these beasts to come after me. Take him down, boy. I'll learn to summon you one day. You look very powerful. Don't mind me. Pay attention to the day drop in front of you. Ha ha, that's right. Scatter. That is cool. Look at that. Ha <laughs> ha. Look how it kind of reforms too. That's really cool actually. I wonder if that stuff will Ooh, that one went far. Alright, focus, focus and focus. Alright, yeah, if we'll we'll use our brain against these foes. Hello there. Ooh, money, 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 money. Alright, I would hate to be cornered in here. 
That's for certain. All these roots. Seems like this, this is a perfect vampire lair. Even little sarcophagi for them to sleep in. I'm here! It's you. Hi. Oh, jeez. Lord almighty, we need to get a better shield spell. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. No, 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 no. We are not gonna die in here. No, 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 no. This is a dead end. This is a dead end. Alright, we need to take these foes outside, and we need to take them outside now. Just in case, these vampires are powerful. We need to get a much better shield spell. See, we can't... It's not wise for us to wear armor, because it'll decrease our spell effectiveness, but... If we put on a better shield spell, we're basically wearing armor. So, we'll just we'll just work on that that alteration. Come on, come fight me, you coward. Just kidding, you're not a coward. But you will die. And they're being vampires, they should be extra weak and they're already burning. All right. Daedric armor. That is a rare find. Where's your blade? Afflicted brethren. Well, I hope I ended your suffering. But jeez. Yes. Really made me work for it. That's for sure. Ah, could this be a blade? Over encumbered, huh? No matter. We'll use our Pat Guar spell and see how it aids us. All right, cool. We can carry some more gear. Perfect. This is we'll make some, we'll make a bit of coin off this. Ah, there's two more of these suckers in here, and I use that term quite literally. Blood suckers. I am here. It's me. Hello. It's me, a sin. Oh, I see. You guys were trapped. You guys were extra sealed. Hello. I just want to end your suffering. Let's not get lost. No time to get lost. Just want to get out. Oh, these caves are confusing. Okay. Let's see, they're definitely on the move. We 
we got to be extra, extra, extra careful not to become encumbered. Let's see, what can we... Oh, we already had it. Favorite it this whole time. Oh, they're definitely coming. Let's check on our little map, shall we? Wow, they're actually not moving at all, so... We're gonna have to take matters into our own hands. Go get him, boy. I'm here. That's right, you put that skeleton in its place. Are these guys ranged fighters? Alright, there goes that one. Whoa. She was quite the archer. I mean, if we were skilled in the arts of uh, the bow, we would be... We'd be in a happy place right now. I think this one is trapped. Oh, wow, we're over encumbered. All right, get him. Yeah, how you like that fire? I can keep this up all day. Haha, <laughs> you're trapped, bub. That's what you get. That's what you get. Wow, we're still over encumbered. Well, I mean, we do have a lot of a lot of stuff on us, so let's just drop what we don't really. Well, let's just drop what's not as valuable to us. Hmm. All right. Can't really carry much. Anything else? Oh man! If only we could carry more. Well, you know what? Let's not be greedy, shall we? We'll just head back to Azura Shrine. But that was that was crazy. Those vampires are tough. I think we need to get some better destruction spells too. I mean, as our magic skills improve, I'm sure we'll we'll get around to doing it. But I definitely want to just be mindful of it. All right, now let's get out of here. Oh, not going out that way. That's for sure. This place is confusing. Please be the way out. Nope. Alright. When in doubt, go up. Oh, cool. We made it outside. I wish there was an alteration spell that, you know, allowed you more than uh, just 
100 points. Like, if I had the magic of Ford and I had the skill, let me just crank that out, you know? Alright, is there a... Thank you, mortal. Ah, yes, I'm glad to help you. And henceforth, above my shrine, five bright candles shall burn forever in memory of their sacrifice. For your service, take this token. That your deeds might be entered in the Book of Fate. Oh, I hope so. And I would love to read that book, because I like books. Look at this, guys. Azura's Star. It's a grand soul gem that you can fill again and again and again. Alright, now with that, we don't have to be so, uh... So careful with our, um... Our soul gems, we really don't have to at all. We'll just crank all this stuff out. And what's cool is this, we've created a conduit with Umbra, which is a soul trap sword. And Azura Star, we have access to. We'll always have souls. So basically, our enchanted gear will be. Uh, we'll be looking good. We'll be looking fly. Alright, that was awesome. Okay, um, let's see. What shall we do next? Huh. Um, what do we want to do next? Let's look at our quests. Uh, pardon my, uh... Pardon my tardiness. Ooh, Vatican is a cave? I thought it was an alien ruin. Well, I think there may be an alien ruin within the cave. Um, hmm. Tell you what. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna end the episode off here... And then we're going to next time go to Vatican, get some more uh, stones, and uh, after that we'll do Sancrator to get the Armor of Tiber Septum. But actually, do you know what? First off, let's sell this loot we got and let's level up. Then we'll do that. Yeah, that's what we'll do. And I like this. We're making money. I want to get a home soon. Ooh. Did alteration increase? Huh, I must have. All right then. I'm All right, then. Let's see. The March Rider. And as is our custom, let's uh seduce them. For better prices. Thank you for closing the oblivion gate. Oh, like I said, I'm for just right happy to price, help. I... We gotta make sure Umbra stays uh tip top have shape. A look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit you. How about you have a look at my wares? Let the good times roll. Look at our gold. Hell That's yeah. That's more. That seems a I'm really curious as to what we'll be sitting at afterwards. That's a All good right. deal. Mm -mm -mm. Look at these prices. That Daedra Claymore is heavy as hell. All right, take these Dwemer arrows. I prefer to call them Dwemer, not dwarves, you know. I'm above stereotypes. Wow, look at our funds. We're doing well for ourselves now. Hell yeah. I am a happy camper. Thank you. Now, seeing as we are still technically homeless, let's head to the let's head to the guild, get a little shut eye, and then we'll uh, we'll call it an episode, shall we? All right, I really hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'm having so much fun. This is my favorite video game of all time, dare I say, and it's most definitely my favorite Elder Scrolls game. I love them all, but Oblivion is just Oh, it's just amazing. And it's so much fun playing as a... Hello. Playing as a mage, because I never... I don't play as, like, a strict mage too often, so... It really is a treat, and I, I'm really happy to be able to share it with you guys. 
All right, let's get a little shut eye, shall we? Ooh, ooh, ooh. The results of hard work and dedication always look like luck, but you know you've earned every ounce of your success. Well, we had to work hard for it, and yes, we're almost maxed out at intelligence. Ooh, could this be it? Oh, maxed out intelligence. Hell yeah, our base magicka is probably really good right now. The results of hard work and dedication always... Okay, now I guess it's going to be the same message every time. That's fine. We are doing well for ourselves. And now with intelligence maxed out, we can start working on maybe our endurance, getting that higher so we can take more hits, you know, have more base health. I'm quite pleased. Let's look at our base magicka. 520. That's pretty good. We're sitting at a good amount of magicka right now. Let's look at our skills. All right, blade is definitely gonna be on the rise. I promise you that. Restoration is pretty low, but like I said, it's hard to really level it. Um, see everything else. We're we're climbing. We're definitely climbing. So good things are waiting for us in the future. So like I said, I hope you guys had an amazing time. I hope you guys keep coming back for more because it's. We're really only getting started. We have so much to do. So have an amazing day, and I will see you guys around. Take care.